A new signing on Panthers TV in association with Jeremiah's Chimney System. Delighted to be joined by new signing, as I say, forward Hugo Wa. Hugo, welcome to the Panthers. Thanks for joining us. Just like to ask, you know, what what's attracted you to come to Nottingham for the upcoming season? Um, I think it was just, uh, you know, the, the team itself, the coaching staff, GM, uh, talking with um, some guys that, that played it in England. And uh, obviously, um, so I, I know uh, one of the players, uh, Carl Neal, pretty well. So he, uh, for a couple of months, he was talking about the Nottingham and he had some great words to say. So, uh, yeah. Yeah, how, how influential was Carl? You've played together before, of course. That, that's always a good step, isn't it? If you know someone that's coming to the same place as you, I guess. Yeah, especially for, for me. Um, we So we, we played a so many years together and being my my first year in, in Europe it's uh, it's always good to to know somebody and uh yeah so he was uh <laughs> he was influential if I if I can say that and how important are those first impressions you mentioned talking to Omar and Jonathan and how impressed you are as a player looking for a new club how important are those initial conversations oh it's uh super important I remember when I Hung up the phone after my first conversation with with Omar and I had this uh, this feeling that this this could be the spot for me and every time I uh, feel in my career that I, I follow my my instinct it was always uh, one of the best decisions so um, so yeah it was was uh, big for me and you talk about playing in Europe outside of, of North America for for the first time just talk us through your thought process of of moving away something you know from away from something that you've been quite used to yeah. Um... I think it was always in the back of my mind for the past couple of seasons. I uh, just was waiting for, for the right opportunity. And also, um, so I remember growing up uh, talking with some of uh, my coaches and they all said that I would really enjoy um, Europe and the European style of, of hockey. So uh, it was always in the back of my mind. I'm afraid we're not quite as warm as Florida. Uh, what what do you know about about Nottingham and, and the UK? Is it, there much that you that you know? You've been better able to find out. Yeah. Um, so uh, no, one thing in Florida. So I started playing golf. So in England, it's a it's a big thing. So I can't wait to to play uh, uh, the links. <laughs> and uh, no, I mean I, I'm from up north. Well, in in Quebec, so I'm I'm used to to the weather, and it's actually. Uh, uh, warmer than what I'm used to. We've got some great golf courses locally, so I'm sure you'll be fine. Just talk a bit about your career. Obviously, you know, you, you played at the university and college, but quite quickly got that chance, you know, in the in the AHL in Milwaukee. Just how was that experience so soon after turning pro? Yeah, uh, it was great. Um, I learned so much and, you know, turning pro at, you know, somehow like a, a young age, um, you need to to get your your game uh, ready, and I, I learned so much, and especially the the first couple of years uh, turning pro, and I feel now um my game is at a, a good spot to to come uh, here in in Europe. And obviously, within the last couple of years, you also played in the AHL in in, in Belleville. Just how hard a league? I've talked to a lot of guys who talk about such a hard league to crack. Everyone's got those you know NHL aspirations. Just what sort of a league is it to play in the AHL? Yeah, it's a it's a tough league. It's a really uh, you no know, tight defensively, and um, I I learned so much about playing you know the right way and all the the little details because uh, if you don't do it well, you're not first you're not playing, and secondly you're on video and the the, the coaches exposes you. So I learned all the 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 little details of the game and how to be a more complete player. Well, it's interesting you say that because you know I look at your stats and obviously. You've certainly in the past few years added a real offensive side to the game. What 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 sort of player do you see yourself as now? Yeah, um, the first thing uh, uh, players, well, coaches or fans sees is uh, uh, my my speed. But I'm a very versatile player that can play in all sorts of different roles. And um, if the team needs a, a big goal or maybe um, shut down some of the the league's uh, best players like I, I can do that so I think it's uh, it's going to be fun to you know play in all of these uh, different roles and different responsibilities 
And just finally, I, I don't know how much you've had a chance to study the roster, but but Omar and Jonathan are, are putting together a roster of, of a lot of guys between the ages of sort of 25 and 28, 29. There's a couple of older ones at the moment in experience. How excited are you? Because, it, you know, it looks like you're all on the same trajectory, same age, you know, youngish, you know, speedy skill. How excited are you by the roster that Nottingham are assembling? Yeah, it's really exciting. I think we're going to have a very competitive team and being a uh, young-ish uh, teams, I think we're, we're all uh, hungry to, to win. And uh, for me, it was one of the, the reason I uh, decided to, to join Nottingham with the, the core players and also the, the vision behind uh, Omar and, and Jonathan. And, you know, being, it's, it's going to be my fifth year-ish pro and I haven't really competed for, for a championship. Um, uh, made playoffs uh, every season, but you know, you, you want to go deep in, in the playoffs and uh, not him being a, you know, historically a really good franchise. So it was uh, also one of the reasons I decided to join. Wonderful. Listen, it's great to talk to you and we look forward to seeing you soon. Thanks for joining us. Thank you.